Hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about how to adapt the NovoPen Echo to fit Lantis or Epidra vials. So normally it takes Novo Rapid and it doesn't work with Sanofi insulins usually. If you haven't seen the NovoPen Echo before, it's a uh, it's a pen made just for Novo, it's a Nordis pen that includes a uh, insulin remind, well it, it records how much insulin you took and how long ago you took it. So once you, when you dial in a certain amount of insulin, let's say four units, and then you dispense it, it'll show you on the back that you put four units in and then around the side it's slow it, it it shows a duration of how long ago the insulin was delivered so it's it helps remind you if you've taken your long acting or just how long ago if you did take a bolus or yeah how much insulin you put in so if you've ever tried like I, I started with uh, Novo Rapid, I've been using Novo Rapid for many years, so I got the pen, uh, but then I changed to a Pidra and Lantus. Well, I already was using Lantus, but I changed to a Pidra for my short acting insulin. And I tried putting the vials into the Novo pen because I, I really like it's not really an equivalent pen from Sanofi, They're no, none of them have digital displays. I think it's kind of unique to. Uh, the Novo range. But putting the vial from an Epidra into the Novo pen, it doesn't work, as I'll show you. So this one at the moment is a, an Epidra vial. As you can see, the, the difference in size is what makes it not work. It's slightly shorter. And just the same with the Lantus. It's lined up on that end, and on that end, it's about a few mil, two or three millimeters shorter. And because of this, the mechanism inside the Novo pen doesn't allow the plunger to push down on the vial. So if you this is already being used a bit. So this is an Epidra vial, the shorter one that doesn't work. So if I put in 30 units, there should be insulin spurting out, but it doesn't because of that shorter length. So the solution I came up with was to first step take off the orange cap from the Novo Rapid pen fill just by pulling it off. There we go. and then you push it onto uh, the Epidra or uh, or Lantus vial, whichever you're going to be using your pen for. Then second step, because it doesn't fit in, if you try to put an Epidra vial straight in, it's too thick, it doesn't fit. So you take off the sticker and then it fits perfectly and then because of the length difference of the two types of vials what I got was the Novo 
Novo Fine Plus needles. I got one of them. And then as you can see on the end here, there is a little um, end bit or like a little lip here. And that so hap just happens to be the right amount of plastic to make up the difference in length. And it also fits perfectly in the end of the um, pen, hold the vial holder. So what I did was just got a knife or saw and cut around there, cut around the edge. And that left me with a little a little uh, spacer and then this spacer goes into the end here and that fits perfectly if you can see now it lets and it is the and it is perfect size this plunger fits directly over the top of this so it doesn't foul the plunger at all it just spaces the in the vial and then you push the plunger all the way back in click it on and you're ready to go let's have a look if it works now we're going to prime it Get the tissue in. And there we are, we have instrument. Okay. So and uh, as you can see, it's only me two and a half units just put in. So that is how you use Lantus and a Pidra in a Novo pen. Hope it helps you.